Hello Collectors, so today I'm going to go over the Lumion Legacy Road map that the developers published about two years ago, almost two years and about, what, two, three weeks, so it's a pretty old road map, and see how they're doing uh, compared to what they said they do. Never put down dates, they just put uh, down the update, or the order of the updates. So update 1 is Lumion Mastery, we have that, uh, we have, obviously you can, each Lumion has two to three masteries, you can level them up and you can get cool prizes for that. It's not really much to go over there. Sephirite City, so let's see, take to Sephirite City, or travel to Sephirite City to take on Oreo's third uh, battle theater challenge and discover what secrets are hiding behind the walls of the Adupia's corporation. That's obviously Blue Corp. Oh, uh, that's with uh, Protagon. Mutagon is Vanti Corp, but close enough. So we get uh, those two, which again, fill in pretty closely. Update 3 is UMB revamp, which we got on Route 8, and that would be you know, bombing stuff uh, to get some cool runes and stuff. Uh, and then it'll allow you to discover rare items for Lumions and Lumions. Um, yeah, you can get Lumions, but rare items, nobody really uses the items. Uh, you think you've got the exchange gem, nobody uses that. Because no nobody uses the Lumions as they need it for. And a lot of people don't even know the use for them, but um, I guess they did add that. So in Battle Theater 4, that's where we're up to. Uh, we haven't got to it yet. But it looks like... We will reach that uh, before this thing turns two years old, so that means we should get about an update every six-ish months according to the roadmap. Um, for update five, though, which will be the one after the, the new city, that would be a brand new challenging cooperative mini game that takes you and your friends on a new adventure every time you play. Battle wild Lumions, solve puzzles, and navigate mazes, and discover what lies beneath Oreo's surface. I assume maybe, maybe not, highly unlikely, but it could be that the maze generation that they tried for the Halloween update is kind of a test uh, proof of concept, I guess, for update 5. Uh, a bit of a crackpot theory there, but it, it's something I believe could be possible, and if so, then that's obviously a good thing. I just don't think we will re get that update until like, at least 8 months after release. Well, actually, I lied. Maybe, maybe six, five, six months uh, after I keep forgetting the city name uh, with the new gym releases. That's just a quick review of the roadmap, seeing how the Lumi Legacy devs are doing. Um, they pretty much followed their roadmap to a T, which is pretty good uh, in general to have. But yeah, that's pretty much it. If you enjoyed, make sure you guys leave a like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next time. Peace.